Oh, man. Hard times, chat. Hard times. Morning. Name's Rack. I'm my coach. And this is the roast. How you fucking doing? Oh, oh wait. I broke it. Hang on. <laughs> How are we all doing, chat? So enthusiastic. Shut up. I'm tired, alright? One of the kittens kicked me out of bed this morning. I'm salty. I'm so salty. So many guys. Can't sleep, so might as well stream. That's pretty much it, yeah. That's uh, pretty much the life I'm living right now, chat. I'm just doing it for the sake of it. Where's those other parts of the thing that I need to bring up? That one and that one. There we go. Just cut all the kittens. I try and then they bite me because they want to play. And I can't play while I'm half asleep. It's too hard. Oh. You see these bags under my eyes, chat? This is the sign of having kittens. Shit's tough. No? Okay. I mean, I can see myself in the stream thing. I look like my eyes aren't even open half the time. It's awkward. I feel like my eyes are glued shut. It's very painful. Very many painful. Oh... <sighs> Anyway, let's get into it before before I get sick, shall we? Why not? That's not the right cue. This is the right cue. All right. So. All right, let's start off, shall we? Did my donate not go through? No, no, it has not. I have not got a notification of any sort, Scarlet. Hang on, check my email. No, no email update either. What's up, Brightglow? How you doing, mate? Pe people seem to not notice that often, Rubix, mate. That's why they're not here. But yeah, please welcome our new mods. Rubix, Lol, Sarah, and Centaurin. Rubix, Lol happens to be here today because good shit. Uh, I think the other two are... One's at work, one's asleep. So, it's fine. But yeah. Um... Yeah, I'm going to start with Bobby then, since uh, we have no sign of no sign of that donation. So yeah, Bobby, you're up. What's that background noise? That's a lot of background noise. I don't usually play DPS, so I don't know what's like the optimum fucking like composition for our like DPS partners. This appears to be an LFG six stack. I saw that right? Hang on. Oh no, they're just friendly. No, they're just friends. Never mind. A Junker or Reaper would be really cool. Alright, uh, what you looking for? A uh, Junker Attack Reaper. Alright, thank you. Let's see how we go then. That's a lot of white noise. I think I'm just gonna. If that gets annoying, chat, just let me know and I'll mute it. But yeah, this is Bubby. Bubby is gold. His hero choice is Lucio, and the first map is Havana. There are two games from him. Let's see how we go. Good luck, have fun, fam. Widow top right. Alright, boys. Nice kill, nice kill. Who thought it was gonna be late? Do people just not read? 
I literally made an announcement and announced it this morning. You don't need to go any further than the shield right now unless you're going to wall ride it. Barrier's already broke, got to go hold back for a bit. You gotta be careful. Hang on. So, quick thing. You can wall ride a shield. No, you can't. You can see that the shield's about to break. But you shouldn't be riding at any point past this because you have no escape route in the open here. So it's very scary to actually be stuck out into this area. When you come this far forwards, if you get stunned up or locked up by anything here, you will immediately get smashed. So just be mindful of, of your position and how far forwards you can go from here. Man's watch is a little too much Reddit Lucio. So this would this would pay off if you could actually aim onto him, but you are standing in the center of their team and not getting punished. So that on its own is a miracle. And a big problem on its own. Is the quality garbage for anyone else or is it just me? I'm dead. Let me just try and open this video in. Brick, here. over here. Oh, that was loud. Mm, it could be worse. Keep it on a Scarlet account, donate 10 bucks. I assume that's for sell out here. If it gets any worse, chat, just let me know. Easy ult. Bad. Good response. If you are going to try and be aggressive, you've got to use the... the I'm sorry, is there a guy named Pot Noodle on the enemy team dead? How interesting. How many are we looking at today? All of them. Is that our pot noodle? I don't think so. It shouldn't be, unless pot noodle is suddenly like sunk into gold. Like he's a GM tank man, he shouldn't be on that on that low. I give you credit for attempting to be aggressive here, but it's such a it's such a risk if you walk front on into McCree and get flattened, but lucky day he was on the other side, so. By the way, if you're ever going to go for this engage, you need comms in advance just to actually allow your team to come forwards with you because if you don't even hit speed boost as you're flying across, then your teammates will not have the ability to chase after you in these situations. Like, they won't actually be able to follow up on you. Like, trying to go for these engages might seem like a smart idea, but getting caught out front on like this twice over is very shitty. Like, knocking the... Like, yeah, without... Like, the biggest biggest issue with this, right, is when you go for a play like this, this might seem like a really cool idea to you about, like, booping away somebody, etc. But when you do this, and you knock at the tank away from your team, what are you expecting to happen here? Like, you're meant to knock your... Like, you're meant to knock this through the shield this way towards your team. If you knock them away, how the hell is Reinhardt going to swing on him? What, you want to make him run even further? Yeah, that seems like a cool idea. You only make it harder for yourself if you don't do the engage properly. There's a hamster behind us. The amount of people that think the Reddit Lucio playstyle is actually the right way to play it are just silly. Like, there is more than just riding off walls and being a dickhead in the back line. Like, it's good for some solo queue players, but it's not the only... It's not the way to play it. Like, there are, there are better ways to be more consistent and safe that actually will allow your team to do much more generally. But instead of you just constantly running in like you're a tank and getting yourself blown up, don't really fucking help in this situation. Oh, here we are. I'm gonna take the reset now. Need 
Your diva definitely should have just taken the death the first time around. Please don't ever try to knock the Doomfist away from you, because you're trying to get him killed. If you're trying to finish him off after his cooldown has been wasted. That's better. Love all we want to do is just lose here. I mean, that's good. But just getting... If in his situation, him getting, like, caught sideways against that. At least, like, Diva was the target there. But it was silly enough for Diva to be there in the first place. So he could have engaged there with um, speed boost. You gotta switch to speed boost faster and more aggressive each time. That was better. There are a lot of times you're just kind of sitting on healing boost with no one to heal and you're not actually like in a spot for, to do anything extra. But yeah. Yeah. Barely wall riding at all is very annoying. Hamster lit. The people who don't know how League works feel when watching. Kinda, yeah. You're a bit brain fucked, though. That's all right. Still, someone contesting point. You got to be aware of that, dude. So if an ult's necessary, it's necessary. Ooh, that's Come on, target call, guys. Fuck. A Not a single right. target call. You'll, like, communicate via telepathy or some shit. Get this doofus behind. Hey, Operator, how you doing, man? So how like Kai Wanda? I didn't see there before. Could have been so much smoother if y'all got it together. Yeah, you're fine, mate. I'm not up to it yet. Doing really wrong right now. This is gonna make you feel better. I mean, if you could aim, I wouldn't mind you being aggressive there, but not the greatest attempt. I'm, I got killed by my oh, going up top. I say, unless you're bumping people off of fire ground, this is pointless, but that went okay, all things considered. Problem is, you just ate the entirety of the, of the cooldowns on the way down. So that was at least Hammer Down and uh, Deadeye. Yeah, Somewhat intended, Rogers, so that people like job. don't think they do the difference. I think not wall riding is probably better no, no, if you no, struggle no, with no, aim and no, don't need to dodge. No, the guy struggles with aim whether he's wall riding or not. Doesn't make a difference. Also, Rogers, it'd be harder to actually um, to decide if you if it was legal or LCS. No one. You know how obvious it, your movement is when you keep jumping up and down in a, in a straight line? Like, people can just see you moving over there. People can recognize the pattern. It's not entirely different. Like, you gotta actually be able to do better movements. I, sorry, guys. I don't know nothing about how much I'm supposed to want it. You don't have to want it, dude. We got, we got pretty far. It's cool. Other people want it purely so that they can fucking be coached. That's the whole point. If you're wondering about how on earth... You, you want me though? That's totally okay, man. But unfortunately, I am I am wanted by by the people just as much. The people want me, man. 
They want that coaching life, you know. I choose you over else, yes, you're a sweetheart. Yep, they have water. But be honest, it's because it's a crappy match at the end of it, isn't it? It's a Golden Guardians match, isn't it? They got me. Fucking rip. Please don't stand away from them. You should you should just be using this wall in the first place. Like if you're actually like not peeking out in the first place, you'd be much safer. If you got caught out in the center there by their widow, it'd be a fucking waste. Absolute waste. I'm kind of glad you managed to like lean away. Walls and corners, walls and corners, walls and corners, walls and corners. Uh, oh, now you're fucked. Cool, oh, got the jump. There's your big mistake. So the other thing, being unsafe, like, you can't actually just put three put down on anyone because you're not watching the play. You're too busy, like, having to run away and having to hide and shit, and that doesn't actually give you a lot of benefit. Looking forward to the back one. Okay. I say flying forwards for that is a big, big, big mistake. Is there a reason we're like flying to the mini diva that's in the open instead of sticking with the team? Just you gotta just use the walls and corners to stay at the back here and just be safer. What are we doing? My vod won't help a ton for me now since I've improved. So just absolutely tell me if I go nuts, man. Why are we pistoling? But again, why are we peeking against the sniper? And again, why are you trying to... What are you doing here exactly? This is such a stupid idea. Why are you out in the open like this? You're trying to play Mercy like you'd play Lucio. How strange. Like, you know the Widow's shooting at you right now, right? But so that's why you're only chance to revive Doomfist inside of that lamp. Getting I'm clapped on again. Do I too much about those single low targets away from the team. I don't understand. I think the guy plays Mercy like, like he plays Lucio. Yeah, like he's just trying so hard to just like be aggressive and be out there in the open. Has absolutely zero positional awareness. There has not been any actual half decent team comps like proactive. They're all after the fact. They're all slow. They're all very much delayed. Yeah, I don't don't go out of spawn, or just like don't go out of the castle. Get four of us. Five. Widow speaking. Healing stream engaged. Take behind cover. Take behind cover. Don't even peek her. Again, not using the wall when you're literally, like... You don't even need to come down from here. Like, if if you use Valkyrie to hold the line and stay in the air, it would still be easier to do. But for some reason, we're just intent on standing in the open. Like, what? Why? You've got the barricade behind you that you can hide behind it and it's still just get max range on. You don't have to stick the staff halfway up their ass just to get a fucking heal out. Gonna die with ulti again. Oh dear. <sighs> well, what are you, you can't do much against a good widow. Like, the beam range is so much longer. Why are we wasting our time trying to run up on, on people and stick that pole up? Like, it's just not worth it at all. All right. Video two for Bubby. Plat DPS, so that maybe that's something to watch out for. Golly, what? Hello. Let's fucking do it, boys. Oh, <laughs> that's not a good start. Right. Straight out into the good shit without actually killing it. Well, does no one actually look out for junk rat traps still? 
Yeah. Game's been out, what, nearly three years now? It would have been fun to watch if you backed on Widow. Maybe. Again, running in front of the tank when you didn't need to. I've got no idea why we still think that's a good idea. Just remember, if you're the first one to die, that doesn't mean everyone else is going to instantly regroup around you when you come to life. Well, it's an alright bump of the tire, but unfortunately you missed the second shot. Makes less mistakes less often is probably why he's higher ranked than you. Yeah, push up, push up. Don't get it twisted though, it's not as if gold is a, is a high rank compared to like anything else. That's right, Kenji. Try to deflect them where Thanks. Feels bad for that guy. Their Genji is fucking awful. The only reason why he's had me is because my nan has been no, I assume these are your friends. A few too many delusions of grandeur, but we got this. You got, you want, uh, what, hold, hold up, grind your alone. Uh, I thought I, I was supposed to get It's alright. I think will still fall for that matrix without actually using the upper wall. I don't, I'll never understand. Like you can literally just go up the elevator and go over the over the wall, but people still insist on going through the front door. I mean, they're running away, and you can still like re-engage on the point. Now you should be able to take this without any troubles, surely. They wasted at least two walls. Yeah, people up there together? No. Do we have communications for it? No. Are we gonna die in the process? Possibly. Again, I don't get why we're being so aggro here. Like, you... It's so awkward to watch a support try to main tank this hard. Holy shit. The toughest lesson for Overwatch was not to play with IRL friends. Because if your IRL friends are absolutely, like, not good at the game and you're trying to get better, then it won't work out. I mean, there's any more reason why before the stream is over, I wonder if I can get legitimate help. Uh, possibly, but you'd have to be quick. Though I sincerely doubt it. Select your hero. <sighs> but yeah, like, it's not as if always playing with IRL friends is a good idea. Like, there's a lot of, uh... There's a lot of, uh... I guess rhetoric is probably the way people talk about it when it comes to play, you know, playing with people that you enjoy playing with is a good idea. It's like, well, it's true to an extent, but like, are your IRL friends always going to be like, like, you know, calm about these games? Are you going to like, let them off for silly mistakes for it? Uh, I think Hog's fine. Alright. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think it's good. Yeah, friends are masters and so GM and I'm bronze, so I can't play with them. Well, believe me, that's the other thing. Would they want to play with you for the possibility that you'd tank their relay so hard? Hmm, that's not illness inducing or anything. What an interesting. 
Let's get this bread, brother. Now let's see how hard you in this time. Nice kill. Damn some, damn some. They're cheaping by. No, they're DPing in front. Right behind. Please don't ever pull your pistol out, it's a waste. Please stop turning your back to the enemy. Please position faster behind your own tanks so that you never have to turn your back to the enemy. I doubt there's Sammy that knows how to TP on that side of the silver. Let me get you patched up. I don't know, I personally think QP is too much of a VS that it will actually try and like learn in. I broke healer LOS, that's my bad. Alright, we're down too, we gotta watch out. Uh, at least you remember to use blue beam. I'm just a little more mad that you're... Oh, here we go. We finally used Valkyrie. It's only a little bit late after the fact. Are we going to heal the Orisa that needs it? Overwatch is our slow day. It pretty much is, yeah. Lack of wins in this chat wounds me compared to other days. It's mainly because of oh, Overwatch. Like, some. Overwatch, we just have not yeah, garnered as much of a base, which is why the VOD review days for Overwatch are so sporadic. It's shitty, but that's just the way it is, man. Like, we just... We just don't have enough people that enjoy Overwatch anymore. Whether it's by Blizzard's uh, issues or because of um, because of Overwatch itself. Did I mention Rainbow Bolt soon? I mentioned I was thinking about it. Yeah. League dead game going on ten years. Yeah. Look. turned out a lot better than it could have. Which is scary. Wreck of used Toontown. Toontown? Imagine not damage boosting Hoggold. Did you not damage boost that? That's unfortunate. You gotta damage boost like high power ulties. Hoggold is one of them. You gotta remember to actually chat like alternate between them faster though. Like you're very, very delayed on doing either or. Changes brought me back to Overwatch, might do the same for others over time, or at least for Overwatch 2. I'm hoping Overwatch 2 will bring people back, man, because, like, it's very hard for me to justify doing, like, Overwatch streams at the moment. When I don't have any mods to do. Why do they do that? They shatter people that are already in, and they all really use crash. They just waste the story at least. You guys are good, you guys are good. On to Lucio again? Uh, sure. It would have been better if you bumped Sorry, the May away charge. from you and then stayed at distance, but that's fine. I mean, yeah, shattering after the May ult's already in process is a good thing, so to speak. Because the layered CC will help keep you down forever. That was a block. Dodge more, man. If you keep jumping up and down, you're going to get caught out. Like, do more strafing. Do more movement. Up 
Look, this guy the short form movement. I don't even have that on file. We got more time on them, it's fine. Round two. <sighs> yeah, we wasted like two minutes of them. Score two to two. Prepare your defenses. Select your hero. Hopefully he sees it from the Overwatch VOD. If he doesn't, then uh, I'm not gonna have a lot of choices here. Three, two, one. All right, this round just focus on staying alive because, like, if like one or two of us die, they got the point pretty much. And this is part of the problem with having this setup. Or if you die, at least try and die early. Still don't get why we're going too far forwards again. You have the range to stay back and you keep coming up forwards. Acting like you're a fucking Lucio is mercy. Whoa, that guy died because you didn't heal him. Nice work. Such silly gameplay, dude. You should res the tall before he goes back up. Too late now. You're gonna make it run the whole way back. Feels bad, man. That would be a wasted res, though he has enough time. It, no. Uh, no, it's not. <laughs> it would take Torbjorn way longer to make it back to the point compared to being rezzed and compared to where the attackers are spawning. That is 100% a lost numbers game from, from the go. Just count. Just count, forehead. But just remember, like, the attackers have the advantage because they will always, always have an advantage if a pick is made before uh, and they get to regroup first. That's why Mercy Res was always so, like, potent. Because the, the capability was there. Ugh. It's a bit strange watching you ult inside of the grav, but you know what? I'm glad you lived, because if you didn't, you were going to get roasted. Why do you keep booping people away? Like, there's no reason to boop them away like that. You should only be booping them, like, towards walls or, like, close towards your team if they're ne if necessary. You don't need to peel them at this point. If you had to peel, then it would be an alright choice to do so, but you're engaging. There's no reason to boop them away. Yep, and they fucked it up too. Family nice banana plate orb. Well, that was pretty sad. Alright. Look, I'm gonna try and overlook the fact that your friends are a little too big for their britches, but look. If you're trying to be this kind of like this aggressive type of support or Reddit Lucio, whatever garbage term you want to put on it, 
I think you need to rewatch this and understand just how many times you actually entered away your life. Like you actually killed yourself that many times over and over again, just because you wanted to try and be aggressive or you wanted to pull out your pistol as mercy. It's stupid. Stop doing that. <sighs> The old positioning is just downright garbage across the board. Like, for the cooldowns that you're using on either character, you're not actually getting any mileage from it because of how terrible your positioning is. If you're trying to be like as aggressive as possible with Lucio, you shouldn't be booping people away from your, from your teammates. You should be calling that you're going to speed boost in. You should be only speed boosting if you're going to bring people like across with you. You should be wall riding more if you're trying to get the, the, the jump on somebody to knock them towards your teammates. As Mercy, you should be like looking at the numbers game and figuring out where a res is necessary. You should be using your Valkyrie, especially like when you're getting before you even get driven back, because you're going to lose a lot of like straight up points if you don't have any throughput. You don't have any AoE healing as Mercy by default, so you need to be able to put more healing down. So that's why, yeah, not not using your ulti at all during Havana was just plain sad. Um. As a general note, I want you to try and remember to max range on everything because you're d just you're trying way too hard to be like glued to the person that you're with, and I mean to the sense that you're actually chasing them out into the open. Very, very silly. Please don't do that. It's not a good idea. It's not safe. It's not worthwhile. Stop wasting your damn time. It's only going to make things worse. Okay. Either way, thank you, Bobby, for your submissions. We'll see you again in the future, mate. All the best. All right. Next person is Scarlet Raven because he's exercised his right to sell the fuck out. And so we shall. 3 a.m. Anna Cool Beans. Why on earth would you send me this is the better question. But this is what we're here for, I guess. So Scarlet Raven is Masters. His hero choice is Anna, obviously. And the map choice, when it wants to fucking load, is Volskaya Industries again. I want to fucking die. More 2 CP. Just what I fucking didn't want. Ugh. Scarlet, why? Why would you do this to me? I thought there was love. Alright, so 3 a.m. Anna. We got the position intact. Good. Still remembering to use it. I'm glad. You fixed the audio delay? I'm glad, bro. Bit aggressive with those skills. At least the nade got value, even though the sleep dart didn't. I say, just have to be mindful that Reinhardt gives losing you to the left. You probably should have said something about that, though. I hope you did. Very aggressive nade. I said, I don't think DPSing here is a good idea. Oh my god, that actually hit? I'm really surprised that that hit. But that's okay. You actually managed to come away with that. Unfortunately, you couldn't get the heal onto McCree because you missed the shot. You didn't pay any attention to the guy behind you and he killed you just in time. That was a solid sleep dart. Don't worry, my body isn't too CP. Thank fucking god, my dude. Sup, Stetrio? Oh. Well, sacrifice that. Lost. You're going to be okay. Might need to get high ground on the back here. Because if you get engaged, then you're going to have trouble. That was almost a perfect take, but yeah.
I mean, you knew that Junkrat was behind you, and yet you still chose to stand on point, and you got cleaned up for it. You gotta be so much more careful about that, because that definitely cost you a lot of that fight. <laughs> yeah, instant loss. If he went for me, it would have broken. That's understandable. Interact key not bound. I mean, if it wasn't bound, how did he go through the teleporter in the first place? That's the that's the confusing part. He still went through the teleporter. Who's winning the thumbnail so far? Nobody. Might be bug with replay. It's true. Maybe. Maybe. Is everyone just running like Ryan Zarya now? Might be time for me to get back into Overwatch. <laughs> I need to jump for that. I just thought you were going to go for that. Oi, down. It would have been pretty funny to actually see you go for that. Men is donated 30 bucks. Says, Keep and dream alive plus I like you. Thanks, man. Meet your love. Such a mistake to let him go forwards like that. You gave the Reinhardt too much confidence that he didn't actually go for his opposite man. That's unfortunate. No target call even involved. Ryan Deaver is what I've seen more, but Zarya is more fun, it's true. This is Ryan Zarya and Lucia. Yeah, it sounds about right. And DPS, it is flexible still. Good shots. Doesn't mean a whole lot if your team starts dying, though. Hopefully no one's noticed you. You can go get up and wait. Hiya. Looks like you're safe. Oh. Well, you survived that. Oh, the sleep. Nice kills, dude. That's what solo queue gameplay looks like right there. You actually managed to get around behind them and put that down on them. Full pressure inclusive. It's nuts. Better on linear maps? Is that what you're trying to say? Mostly just May and McCree or Reaper? Yeah, it makes sense. I don't think keeping Reinhardt alive with Nano Dart, etc., is going to really help him do any DPS here. Especially since. Oh, never mind. He actually survived long enough to make a turn. There you go. Nice work. Good healing. Hello, Rack. I have come to collect my blade. Forge over 300 falls. And to cry about how Overwatch used to be. That's unfortunate. Uh, I'm this meta. Div is better on both linear and horizontal because... Linear and horizontal makes no sense as a term. You mean vertical, I assume. Well, the world's easy for Diva with the three second boosts and just fly above and eat stuff instead of instantly melted bubble. I mean, you got instantly melted bubble versus if, if Diva doesn't have Matrix, she instantaneously gets melted. At least for Zarya, her positioning's a little bit better for the brawl. Whereas Diva kind of suffers out without any actual main tech backup. <laughs> so being aggressive is pretty tough.
So the, the damage value that uh, D.Va has compared to Zarya at close range is pretty different though. A close medium range. You know, like it's a big difference. Like a fully charged Zarya beam off of good shielding is actually worth a lot more. In almost every situation. If you play Arisa or Sigma, you're throwing. It's weird that not even a month ago, what is the complete opposite? so hard to imagine that like it used to be the complete reverse not long not even that long ago i'll let you walk into a lot of spam just a bit unfortunate Walk backwards into that feels bad. Same problem again, but this time he actually blocked the wall properly, so you can't stop it. Unfortunate. Missed the sleep dart, couldn't get away from her. At least you stayed out of range here. You know, one thing I've been meaning to figure out about you, Skull, is like, when do you actually differentiate between wanting to use one or the other for, um, like, for safety, like, quick scope versus, um, just standard shots? Also, I don't know why we came so far forward here. It's always safe. In high, I assume that's Elo. Always Zar on KR and Anubis, unless they're against Junk. I mean, that's pretty specific for two specific maps, but yeah, that would make sense. Not the greatest use to cooldowns all at once, but at least we're getting some ground. Crappy nade. I so someone's gotta die. Oh, you missed the sleep dart. Feels bad. Yeah, should be fine to take this round, just provided everyone kills the target. Yep, easy. I just peeled off here because if you stayed on the point and got cleaned up, I was going to be mad. Mm -hmm. Not the greatest time back. What do you take me for? Unless you lose, I can take you for whatever I like, Scarlet. It's part of the job. 
That's the best part about it, is I can take you for whatever I like. It's kind of annoying. If there wasn't buff so much, I might have actually been an Ash Matter. I mean, yeah, that would pretty much corner that market. But I think that's kind of part of the problem, isn't it? Like, if if Diva isn't somewhat prevalent, then, like, hit scan DPS just kind of take over the game. Wait for hero bands. If hero bands actually become a thing, it's going to be nasty. Are they actually following through with the hero pool thing, or nah? Oh, nice. You actually didn't get shielded in time. Hilarious. Still ate that fire strike, though, which is unfortunate. Wait, as in yes, they did away with it, or yes, they're keeping it? The hero pool thing. Yes, they're doing hero pools, that's unfortunate. Not a fan of that concept at all. Good. Running back across the middle was a very risky plan. Honestly, I got nervous for a moment there about how much it was actually get, like how much value you were going to get from that ulti, but you managed to still somehow get some of it, which is kind of crazy, all things considered. The Ryan is going in. This is true. Watching Overwatch for the first time in years is so weird. It's a little bit how you going. Everything's weird for you today, Sarah. Having the sword, watching Overwatch. It's a hard, it's a weird day, huh? What's next on the wonderful weird life of Sarah? Mm-hmm. Weird champ. Maybe I'll go watch a bizarre adventure. Is that a weeb we reference? Good sleep. Thank you, pay attention. It's kind of praying that there was some sort of communication there. Because he couldn't exactly put it down if he wanted to. Really? I just, I like hero pools because the meta becomes stale after a while. The meta is stale because the hero choices suck. Ton taking more, taking characters out and pigeonholing people into other picks doesn't particularly make that good. Everyone's so aggressive all of a sudden. Grenade soon. I think you just were waiting so hard for the value there. Hey look, it's Torbjorn. Nice punch. Nice. Very nice slick dot. Coming 
Why am I in lead category? I shouldn't be. Hang on. I updated it again. Did it work? Thank you for following 64. Thank you for following Cryptic Noob. It worked? Yeah, okay. So it didn't work the first time. Thanks, Twitch. You died while I was looking away. Usually it's the tanks that suffer because they can only play like two or three heroes all DPS, always become the case that can shut down my entire I mean that's part of the problem though, like the the tank and support pool are too shallow to actually like to like have hero pools that will just immediately shut them out. But then again, like there are only specific DPS that work with specific tanks, like generally by default as well, so it just gets weirder every time you think about it. There's a boostio. Who who called it? Who is ready for the boostio? Got a boostio right at the end. <laughs> I got you. Thanks, man. They want a better meta for choice. They need to learn how to design the game. Correct. It's very hard to actually like get choices out when you're very much suffering in a stale game. But that's very hard to to do that, I suppose. sec before I finish my review I'm just answering a DM but yeah so Scarlet I, I'm trying to understand something right with all the extra steps Calzone's what type of how is that a figuring it out one of mine shorter seasons in trade for specific meta in each one could even bring goats back for one season only. I mean if the idea is that the hero pool dictates the season then I would work with that but hero pool changing week to week that's pissy it's very pissy. Anyway, so Scarlet Raven. I don't know what it is, right? But I swear on way too many often occasions in this game, instead of just being like consistent and just changing up between your shots, you were kind of just funneling on the need to just go without the quick scope. And I was really feeling like your throughput suffer in some situations, especially when you could have like gone above some thresholds, to, like some healing thresholds to actually be able to turn and be aggressive with Sleep Dark. There were a lot of like those situations that kind of perked up that warranted you having to use your grenades earlier. There were a lot of like biotic grenades that you threw out just for the sake of them in order to just try and stay ahead of the healing curve. But it's not as if like you were like properly getting the most throughput out of healing in the first place. Positioning was all right in the first half, but it started to dwindle later later as the game went on. Uh, I admire the cheeky aggressive flank you did on the on the first point of a t of a sky attack. That was pretty cool. Um, just as a general note, though, you don't want to get caught out doing that, or you're just going to get flattened, and you're going to end up staggering your team. So just be mindful. Uh, there's a lot of let me think. Fleet darts are actually pretty good for the most part. I was going to criticize them, but they're actually pretty solid for the most part. Apart from one bad boost, yo, the nano boosts were fine. No, it's kind of strange that Reinhardt still lived through a couple of them by default, but it's kind of odd like trying to throw nano onto someone when they're being CC locked right down. That boost, yo, was on purpose. You're a horrible person. They have 12 stars, 12 tanks, and two more DPS. Hero bands are pretty good, but there aren't enough heroes. For it. There's, ne there's not going to be enough heroes for that for a very long time. Like, you can't... Like the hero pool system and the like, the the, the, sh the pools are just too shallow. Like, there's no way you can actually get good benefit out of it. Nano boost does not increase healing taken. No, it'd be pretty broken if it did. Then the biotic grenade does, but that's on a different time and path. 
But yes, thank you, Scarlet Raven, for your video. This is pretty solid work. Maybe playing at 3 a.m. is a bit awkward, but we'll see how we go. All right, next one is Hudson. So this is from a tournament game, if I remember correctly. It's a tournament, uh, tournament match from the GGNA Intermediate. ECB versus Bamboozlers. Video is bamboozling me a little bit. Oh, here we go. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Alright, so Hudson is a platinum tank player. He's playing Reinhardt to start and we're on Rialto. Let's see what we got. Oh the sellout. Sorry, Medi. It's only short though. I'll get you right after. My apologies. I'm sorry, man. I'm so tired. I'm not thinking ahead of it. Hello Emrecchia, how you doing, mate? Yeah, I'll get you right after this, Medi. Should have charged earlier for that one, because you already had the Maywall in place. Comms have to help you out for that. Keep the shield up, keep the shield up. You can't afford to shield up when you're getting like aggressed on that hard. You sometimes just have to take the hit on your shield. Every time this wall goes up and you guys don't act on it, that really bugs me. Should have charged her into the short wall. You've got all these perfect charge spots to actually like work with. Assuming that people actually come together for it. Well, that turned out better than it should have. Nice stun. Nice. As late as this play can he shoot bounce past you, by the way. Yeah. Oh, easy stagger. But yeah, the comms around that May wall were really shitty because no one actually got together and actually did the play, like, initially. So the, the biggest problem there was, like, you don't actually get any benefit from, um... You don't actually get any benefit from managing your shield versus managing uh, or goat herding their Reinhardt against the ice wall. If you don't actually do anything for that, it's shit. Wasted nade on stagger? Yeah, a little bit. But, I mean, in most cases, I would still have to wait for Diva, so it's not too bad to waste the nade. And so that was purely just to break shield, and you guys should have just moved out of the way. You guys 100% should have just disengaged off to the right there. So when you see an ulti like that happen, you want to just disengage off to here and just keep yourself hidden because she can't shoot around that corner. Just a waste otherwise. True, is still a wasty nady. Wasty nady. Yes. Wasty nady indeed. I mean, with this, you should be running in. It's a waste of an ult. He's going to get ult before you at this rate. Don't even, I better say, don't even fire strike here. When I said don't even, it was don't fire strike, and that was exactly why. If you fire strike, you can't animation cancel into your shield fast enough. And you gotta like work on being able to block those fucking shots, man. Ugh. Oh. Shielding for almost all of B. What fit? Yeah, look, it's pretty shitty. Shielding for almost all of the B, not getting any aggression off, and then still being pushed outwards by by the enemy whilst having nano boost on. That's not the kind of aggression you wanna see. Especially when you've got so much freedom to use it. You let the enemy Reinhardt get on the front foot there, and that's how he got his ulti off before you did. It's a bit shit. <clears throat> Wreck, you must consume rest and oxygen. Yeah, look, I'm trying, man. It's very hard. <coughs> Did May block that? It looked like she was about to. That fucking May wall, eh? The, the, where's the comms on that one? That's what I want to know. That's that's the one that's bugging me. Like, when comms are that shitty and, like, that goes to hell, it's just awkward. So far, no one is winning the thumbnail. That's cool, bro. Did he not say he was going to show? It's very hard to figure this out because no one's actually running this together. 
Probably the worst time to go for that too, just given that she was still nanoed in the center. <clears throat> wasn't worth the charge, especially into the fact that uh, Farah had so much available. You guys are getting absolutely ruined by that, Zara. Why are we charging? What? That was just 100% all you should be doing there is jumping forward with shield. Holy crap, you should have gotten punished so much harder for that. Such horrendously, like, over-aggression there. Fuck the team, I'm a charge. Yeah, look, you might be onto something. Fucking hell. Watching your back. Don't worry, my friend. I have your shield. Sixty seconds I feel like that right there was them engaging and not realizing that the enemy had ult advantage and not having anything to work off of it. Like, sometimes when you have to dry run for that in order to stay in the game, you should just, like, pressure forwards. You just waste it otherwise. You get staggered. <clears throat> you gotta learn, like, some economy right here. Because that's how you guys are getting ruined every single time. You don't need a fire strike when you've got a full ulti. It's pointless. It only gives the uh, the enemies extra stuff. Wasted. Should be closer if you're ever gonna attempt that. Shield. It's just shitty play overall. Should have just fire struck towards the floor rather than the air. I don't know if I were to run charge on 100 HP, you need to run in front of him twice. This means he's going to five five every time. Yeah, it's shitty. Some Reinhardt, some like tank players have just never played Reinhardt like in hard metas before, and they just think that they like whenever Reinhardt's at the top of his game, they can they should just be getting like funneled every single time, and it's just shitty. Like bad Reinhardt players are like the master Yi players of fucking Overwatch. Like they just always think that they should just get funneled every single time. Yeah, there was a ch a chance, but not the greatest idea. That's free because he made the shit charge. That's cool. I don't know how on earth you actually managed to miss a close range fire strike, but we'll leave we'll leave that behind. But yeah, they're probably not actual Reinhardt players. Glow. They're probably like you know like a more aggressive tank like sort of players like Winston and like Wrecking Ball and shit, and they just try to like be that aggressive. Literally ulti there, dude. Like, literally ulti there. Jesus. Better. Actually created coverage so that McCree could get away with that. Ryan's all used to being pocketed tend to be garbage. It's true. So you with a Ryan like a dive tank. Unless you have a good synergy with your team going on your fuck. I mean, yeah, look. That's how I managed to get my team into Pro League ages ago, like when I was in Season 1, because I would just play, we'd play like Reinhardt Hyper Aggressive and we'd just dive backline the whole time. And then, like, we it managed to get us into Pro League, but then we obviously had to start adapting once we started playing against smarter players. And yeah, because people did, we couldn't adapt very well when we got fucking ruined. True probability, like a really good of a so climb last minute. Maybe if it was, if it was Orisa, they know how to play defensive. I would say it's like a tank that probably got to like the height of, from like the dive meta, if they're going aggressive like that. But then again, Orisa's meta was literally just do everything at once because you're amazing enough to do so. Also, what is this bit right? 
trying way too hard for some of these fire strikes. Two swings would, would give just as much ult charge without wasting the animation for free. Easy clap. Just go for the free target. Stop trying to fire strike the air, dude. You're not a sniper. Another shitty charge. Yep. Both Reinhardt players are just meatbags getting caught out over and over again. It's kind of hilarious. So you gotta try and take the swing out as early as possible, but it's fine. You managed to get away with that, so it's cool. I mean, isn't that just Ryan players? Not always. <laughs> this is how Ryan play, is it? Plat. Two people waiting for each other to do dumb fucking charges. I'd agree. That or bad fire strikes. I want salad and wings. Salad before wings, huh? Interesting. Don't do it from this distance. Go closer. Oh, yeah, he's back to you there. That was almost worth it. The fact that that actually still hit the McCree and no one else is just interesting. But man, there's just absolutely no play happening here. You keep trying to go for your, like, for your shatters from so far away and you don't expect him to react at all, which is really awkward when you think about it. Like, you should be doing that. Take a shot every time he's got hammer down as a shield. I don't think you guys are going to be very well but to do by the end of this. You can't stagger a person that's holding your point. That's more like it. Didn't actually charge like an idiot either. I'm very glad. Both Divas are just hardcore inting in this game. I wonder how many deaths they both have. Works out because he was preoccupied with you. Can't get a shield. I love how he keeps shooting his fire strike at the diva. He just wants to fucking send it airborne, dude. He's just yeeting it into the fucking sunset. Alright, my man. I'm going to just warn you now. At the very least, like, it's good that your charges are all short range, but the timing of them is just atrocious. Stop, like, going for every single one thinking that, like, you can just punish each time. Some of them are just very terribly timed, and you're going to get punished even harder than you believe, especially against better players. Um, stop trying to fire strike people that are in the air. Stop trying to fire strike when you know the enemy Reinhardt has ultimate, and stop losing the footing if you're not just going to be, like, directly, uh, like, taking the economy death each time. Like, if you're going to keep going on the back foot, you're just going to give them more ult charge just for that kill every single time, and you don't want that. You have to actually move forwards. If you have to take the death, then so be it, but don't fucking waste your time just pussyfooting around expecting to not get killed. Play scream yesterday, kill the deal because I thought you don't stagger in scrims, but the team said that's no longer the case. Did it change? What do you mean you don't stagger in scrims? I thought the idea of not staggering in scrims is just to get the most time out of practice. Like, your team would know that it's a stagger. Like, you can work with it. It's just etiquette. If you have to practice staggering, I guess you guys could come to an agreement. But that's really up to, like, that's really up to the management of both teams. Staggering is still a part of the game, whether you like it or not. But yeah, you got to stop shattering at mid range. It's so easy to react to if you're, if you're standing like in front of you and can watch you do it. 
you either got to be closer or you got to force him out of his shield a lot more. You're not doing either, and it's making it very easy for him to just block your ult. <sighs> Made it to Silver on Apex. Nice, mate. Unfortunately, I have no idea how the Apex ranks work, but I can assume that's a, it's an upgrade nonetheless. Stay behind car to block the other runs visibility. That too. But yeah, just you gotta just maintain your like your position and just jockey to get closer to the enemy rather than just like constantly getting cleaned up over and over again. You're just gonna like you're only gonna lose out if you don't properly do any of these particular like it's like it's like taking an inch just to get towards the enemy. It's just wasteful otherwise. Either way, thank you, Hudson, for your video. I hope to see another one from you in the future, mate. Alright, Medinis, where are you? Medi, where are you? Oh, I've got to check your DMs. Hang on, Medi. Yep, I got you. All right, first Medi news video of the day. With that low health, Rialto, here's a good map. Met it is rank gold hero choice. Why is this whole thing in Japanese? Sweet Lord, <laughs> hero choice Orisa. Orisa map choice Rialto. I like the font, but I really, like, I never knew about the Japanese. You shouldn't be running Orisa. For starters, you shouldn't be running Orisa. You're a terrible Ryan. I mean, we've already seen the Reinhardt before, Medi, but it's still. Which you could vote for a map, that'd be interesting. Live in chat, that's good. Alright, let's do this. But oh, you better pop off. Five, four, three, better get some good. Hey man, that Ryan tried his best. I'm not talking about the previous Ryan, I'm talking about Medi's Ryan's. Previous times. They have a Roadhog left side, watch out for pulls. You say that right as you stick around from, uh, from ahead of your shield. You deserve that. Of course. I even said to watch out for him. I, I like I like how he, literally his, his face just sunk when he realized that he did that too. I do. I'm still At least our widow is popping off. Now. Oh, Medi. <laughs> Never change, man. Never change. This is partially... Like, if you at least reacted with Fortify prior to him hooking you, you might have been okay with it. But again, you just didn't either. You didn't react. You didn't, like, take out on anything. You just got smashed over and over. In the room yeah, it's dead. McCree and May, or Reaper and May. I'm so glad May is a staple in this game, whilst Reinhardt is one of the better tanks. Just kidding, it's fucking sad. Should probably look at halting them. Oh, no, not like that, Medi. Where's this on at? We say headshots don't even matter if you get shot by Ana, so don't even bother. Alright, now move forward. You fortified nothing once again because your shield was still blocking the way. Shoot him in the head. In the head. That's alright. He dead. You didn't see that? Sure I didn't, bro. Sure I didn't. I might be falling asleep still this entire stream, but I saw it. They added a rank system to Pokemon Sword. Is it good? Is it? Is there any point in it? So 
Sorry, chat. Everyone just abuses legendaries. You can have legendaries in a ranked mode? What? It's a bit silly. Dragons! <laughs> no one can see it, but I can see Maddie's camera. I just watched his full head swerve out of the way of the dragon. You just fortified nothing again, Medi. Yeah. Rules mode and no rules mode. Why would you have a ranked with no rules mode? That's stupid. That's stupid. Face cam VOD reviews. It's a possibility, but I my camera it blocks the way because I'm nice. <laughs> oh, yeah, he just did that. Okay, where's our team at? Are we ready? Yeah. What is with all the, all the people in your game just, like, suiciding? Also, why are we chasing Bob? God bless America. Anna, seriously? Oh, man, why do I feel like I'm fighting alone? Because you behind? technically are. Well, you were the only one fur know. front up on the point, and you did not Holy have God. shield down. And you, just to make matters worse, you targeted Bob, of all people. Putting drum down without a shield is a big mistake. We could use a reaper. Oh my god, I can't do shit. You shouldn't even be peeking without the shield down, bro. There, but this is also part of the reason why you don't see uh, many Arisas anymore because the shield just gets bulldozed before you can do anything. <clears throat> yeah, I'm coming. We gotta go up there together. A lot of times I'm by myself and everyone else. <sighs> uh, Winston's behind in the room. Pulling Bob is unnecessary there because you can just shoot him in the head. Shield in one. Since he's standing still the whole time. Hog's going up left, behind us. He's dead, he used ult. I'm so glad you didn't fortify and just get, take the whole entire damage thing to the face. It was very scary for a moment. Yeah, I know. That's why I said I'm glad you didn't. I want to see a bronze ball. What if I swear we have one last last roast? Oh, it was silver. Oh my god! Kill the fucking hog, man. Seriously. Becoming more of a problem. Maybe slightly tilting you, yeah, I understand. Arisa versus Bob, Electric Boogaloo. Good replace the shield. 
Didn't have Holt ready to just grab the Winston as he landed, unfortunate. Could have put that off. Yep. Could have put your shield down a little bit faster than that, and then just stay positioned with it. But again, not against that, not against Blade, it won't be strong enough. Trap hand tie the gem. Do you must. Is that his name? Seriously. Yeah. So it is. Well, wow. that's just saddening, isn't it? One. It's a little more like it on the aggression. Sent halt too far. Good kill though. Got driven away. Feels bad. I noticed things. Oh, I wonder why, Sarah. I wonder why. <laughs> I wonder why. Thank you, Tywin, for the follow. Died with Fortify up. He does that a few times, yeah. Unfortunate. Oh boy, are we going to the Reinhardt? No. I mean, the problem is that generally using Orissa is a bad idea right now. They have a Bastion, shield's dead. No, this is part of the problem here. You're just going to keep having your shield melted while you're trying to do anything. Weeb. He might be. Don't know what gave it away. <sighs> Just give me a sec, chat. <sighs> How does sending you a VOD work? <sighs> Exclamation point VOD in the chat. We'll get you what you want. Am I okay? Look, I, I've got a really bad chest pain, and uh, my breathing's a bit. How you going? But I think I'll be alright. Hence the coffee. <coughs> Should be alright. Go down. Children four. Still getting melted. No point in sending right click out against that. Bad shield, sorry. Shield was too far forward. Oh, damn it. You gotta aim lower, dude. Ryan, I don't know if Ryan would be much a better choice. Yeah, this is part of the reason Aris is just not valued right now. Oh my god. It's just gonna get melted over and over again before you even get to the play. This ult is not gonna do shit if I can't even get to the fight. We're split. Two people are dead, so don't engage yet. Now three people are dead, this is why we group. See, is everyone here? Well, it was a pretty good pull, but it was a little bit late. Too much backing off and not enough space holding. This is true. 
But then the problem is when he finally realizes that he walks in and dies because no one else is around to even help him at that point. Which is not particularly helpful. Oh, I can't switch. That sucks. The shield's being like placed in the in the open. Baptiste up top by himself. Uh, well, I don't get why we ended up trying to flank while the point's still pushing past you again. Ah, oh, shit. Like, what, 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 time, what kind of ground are you hoping to hold if you keep, like, moving back and forth from this? That's a loss you just took on. Just because of that. Ugh. Tank player is giving Rek a heart attack. Unfortunately, I had the heart attack before your tank play, so I couldn't just blame you for it this time, Medi. But yeah. <clears throat> Staying between top is pretty bad. Sub Legion. <sighs> Sorry, Chuck, give me a sec. Oh, never want to be too far from a corner. Staying between two is pretty bad. Yeah, that, that makes sense. That makes sense. Look, it's probably nothing, chat, so I'm just going to keep going. Alright. Meta is video 2. Twenty-four. Because <laughs> it is good. Okay. Montage, in my opinion, is, my, is the best. Uh, don't forget team chat. Hey, how's it going, everyone? Hey. I almost thought you said my name there for I could put a T period, but anyways. And a gameplay some more. Cool. So I can ask together. For. Let's see here. What are the gamers that say we're in this with their blocky? It's because he's got Japanese text. Teleporter top left. Oh, that sucks. That's only one. Only two went through. Also, hello, Mo Degenerous. How you doing? You actually hit a sleep dart there. Cool. Remember, you don't have to be too close to them to actually do this. You just got to be safe and you got to be able to have a sightline. That's all you need. Sleep died of nothing. Your grenade didn't help the purple situation oh, there. Lucio here. 
I got the stun. Out of space on my mouth. I'm in the back line. Why is Zarya chasing me? Is Zarya chasing me? It's rather aggressive night again. I'm changing to the so at least we're finally remembering to use the scope sometimes. Probably should have just grabbed the health pack just for run. posterity. Yeah. Uh, people usually ask that. A little lead off the trigger either way. I'll go around when I die. Okay, I Awareness is really, though. like, losing it here, uh, Medi. You're not aware. You like, like you, you and no one else are actually repositioning when the time is necessary. Jessica, Jessica, Jessica. Yeah, they teleported back. Yeah. Like there are too many like off situations where you're just getting caught out because you're not able to rotate back to like in front of the payload or like get safe. You're just getting like you and your teammates are getting caught out. Someone's got to be able to call this and actually get yourself back there. I would rather it be you, obviously. Okay, we like together. Maybe. Yeah. I'm gonna Winston just to die the back line. Hello, Gangly again. How you doing? Wow, that. I would have rather used the corner there. You could have sleeped out of the Reinhardt. No Never mind, he didn't make it to the end anyway, so it's cool. Oh, thank you, Legion, for the 200 bits, which I love, dude. Doing nothing, losing life. Losing life? You're not losing life. You know, this game. You're actually hitting sleep darts, all things considered, so that's kind of useful. Yep. Yeah, we had a bob out. Lean too far down. Multicore behind. Not so much behind, I think he's above you. I think both of them are above you and you're not aware of it, actually. Both Sim and Torb were up there and you weren't actually near each other. That grenade was wasted because you, the guy you wanted to heal didn't get it and you weren't near him enough to get it for yourself either. Good sleep. Hope you know coronavirus. I don't think I have coronavirus, but I do think I am coming down with something. And if the chest pain gets any worse, I might have to cut stream short and go see the doctor. Good key opportunity. Who did not see that coming? I did not know I had the torture. Right about here. And get him. Ah, failure. Ryan's purple. No, I don't like that. Hey, uh, I should be alright though, chat. Don't off. worry. You go, uh, or Man, this is. I'm American, so all I can offer is thoughts and prayers. You can offer money. <laughs> I'm kidding, though. I want to play League, but League very broken. Oh my god, I'll play this Platinum and Dying play. It's very hard to get points. Oh, come on, you're better than that, Ganglia. You can get the points. Tell you what, don't give me one break game. Acquire the points. There you go. Lucio's right side in the room. <laughs> Look at that healer trainer. Oh, thank you, God. What's your yeah, you need you. cover I spots, man. You've got no There's cover. Tree, like, way the fuck over there. You haven't utilized cover on either game so far at all. You're barely using it. You're very much in the open in both games. I have nano, probably mid next fight. I'm glad you're alive, Legion, mate. <sighs> Very behind on the left. I'm gonna try to just stay in this general area for a hot second. Ryan's anti. Nice anti. Charging. Sorry, I slept. Stairs Good behind. Sleep. Coming. He's behind you. Where is he? Oh, he's just. He's still in that okay. spot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
I you're nading nothing, there. sleep dotting nothing. Uh, McCree's uh, stairs right nothing. side in the room. Looking for a good queue opportunity. Go all the way behind, behind, behind. Did you just get interrupted? You did. You got interrupted. Because you actually went ahead and fucked up again. By being aggressive with it for no reason without using cover. not a good ult combo to sit there. What, you needed high ground and you needed to just take the line, dude. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Just take the high ground up, line it back. Anyways, let's win this. It's not as if they have any snipers to fucking cut you down this time. Oh, you got charge. I kind of personally think it would be better to erase it, but... Mine's anti. I got you, Diva. I'm reloading. Yes, what is it with the still feeling the need to take, like, aggressive positioning and be, like, this far forwards? Like I saw, when you, the moment your team gets pushed back, you're gonna get like shoved no. out, and you're gonna get killed <laughs> since you don't have any way to reposition. It's not good. Again, not using the cover. We got 30 seconds. Zarya, Zarya, help with Zarya, 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 Zarya. Um. Thank you, May. You are a godsend. You're not supposed to jump in front of the. Uh, you can't thank May for the wall and then jump in front of the wall, bro. You just stay on the high ground and actually be safe. Like, you can literally jump from the wall up onto that high ground place and stay safe. Wasteful otherwise. Oh, man. Still having trouble with wall riding, I see. Kill the turret, please. I would, but if I if I go for it, I'm turret's almost dead. Just gonna get yelled at for C9ing. Oh, there we go. I got First it. down. Keep holding that. Dude, he wanted to shot. Moira. I'm here. Oh, damn it. I'm like literally here. Didn't make it. <laughs> Hello, Garnet. AK Glow. No worries, man. As long as you're fine. Instead of a plow. Nice wall. Ah. Uh. Oh, that was just got bad. First down. Shh, keep pushing it. Careful, careful. Okay. Back. Behind, behind the nice one down. Swept. You get in the back. Or behind. Keep getting, keep getting, keep Sorry, getting. The All the way. How do you keep getting caught way. out by being ahead of the tanks wow, again and again? Like, are you asking yes. to Pro get done over? Yeah, That's a good sleep. You can get the shot or the punch after that, though. Very oh, annoying. There's more on cart. Mora's <laughs> on cart. Need help with more on cart. Oh, more. I thought you did Mora. Yeah. Oh, shit. I got the Mora now. It's Sombra. Slumber's in her back line. Uh, she has to help back that's in there. Got my Q. Of course she hacked me. 
Not using cover again. You gotta look for more cover spots, man. You're relying on the payload and May way too often, and you're not actually like utilizing any cover. That's why you keep getting caught out in the open, or you end up over aggressing past your tank. Got her. behind with core oh my goodness gracious got hacked got just ran straight at you guys when you copped it again don't step in this bridge did you have sleep dot for that yes Sorry, you did man. didn't even react in time with that either <laughs> that's take that tour you piece of shit <laughs> <laughs> gets the callback <laughs> Well, he's like super annoying. Now I'm gonna do my Q. You got it. Bad day! Stay down. Stay her down if you can. I'm gonna try and avoid like being in a position where you have to jump no, back over the payload down. to heal someone. Just down. use your range more. I'm going back, I'm going back. Remember, Anna's a sniper. You don't you don't want to oh, use a like a really bad version of Mercy where you have to stick that like the stick up their ass. I like it's hate not worth getting it. Caught off guard like that. Oh my goodness. Like, it's not really caught off guard when he's right in front of you though. That's the problem. Like you are very okay. very Sorry, obvious good. here. Or if you're <sighs> You gotta be fucking kidding me. Get back in the fight. Eyes on the bad guys. Yeah, let's go forward. Tomer in the back. You, you don't want to keep backing up towards your teammates, though. You yeah. just want to use the cover and just dance around it. Oh, they dumped me. There you go. Better. There you go, junk. God, this summer's annoying. Um, Still getting caught out. Attacking me in the back. You gotta like either go high ground here or just stay back, man. Like you can't just keep going up. If you're at least alone in the back, oh you can turn and onto Sombra and put her to sleep if she's there. But if you get sandwiched between her and Reinhardt, you will lose each time, no matter what. Okay, we're together. I'm going leftish. Eva's on church. Oh my god. Sombra dead. Oh, he's jizzing on me. He's jizzing on me. <laughs> what a fucking. Hey, we just went around. <laughs> <laughs> hey, there, there's a Ryan there. Watch it, Mora. Mora, there's a Ryan behind hey, you. Be winning, but okay. Oh, damn, team. Hey, you want. That's my team. That's my team. There we go. My dick hard. Nice. Okay, you ready for that Q action? Nanoboot is charging. Tell you what, I'm ready for this injection. Somewhere. somewhere. More purple. Then again. Nice. It's somewhere in the back. I feel like I've entered the twilight zone where everything's gone quiet and I'm just kind of like cruising, coasting, watching Medi do the same thing at the same time. Cruising, coasting, losing it the whole way across. Fur down. Nice. Ryan slap. Oh. oh, this is bad. Oh, the wall. Me. Okay, good. He made it. Andro's top mid. You want to try to be like. You want to angle it down a bit more so that not only are they getting like the grenade, but so are you. Because in those situations, you kind of want to be a bit close enough to actually get that as well. So you don't get melded down by that ball there. But. 
made I mean, the roll. I shoved both the tanks in the corner, so like, I'm surviving. <laughs> I'm good. And I just killed the Rhine. <laughs> With a melee. Watch out for the hand soap. Yeah. Nice. Oh, what the fuck? Hey, Hanzo behind you. Hey, Hanzo behind you. <laughs> Punch him, dude. Punch him. There you go. I killed Hanzo. I need some heals super bad, though. <laughs> Thank you. Ryan's fantastic. Hey, Tor behind, Tor behind. Oh, it's just in everywhere. Oh, good. Missing all those shots. If you quick scope two of them, you probably wouldn't have missed off the tracer shot there, but it's fine. <sighs> Behind. Oh, he's almost down. He's almost down. Oh, let's go. Stay on it. Stay on it. <laughs> so you can't see not now. That diva bomb was very good. That diva ate my freaking nade. That sucks. Mm hmm. Damn. I went down. That's the point, that's the point. 4K. 4K. Sorry. Damn, good try. Yeah, that was a good yeah, hustle. Good try, but yeah, there was just way too much dawdling around the mid game and just trying yeah, to get things done that you couldn't. A lot of the problems in this game really just turned into, like, can I get this grenade off or can I position like this and not get punished for it? And in a lot of those situations, you were just positioned too aggressively, too far forwards, and you got punished for it every single time. And it's not the good kind of, like, punishment that, like, results in, like, everyone getting together and actually, like, collapsing on the enemy. It's literally just times where you just get caught up, cleaned up, and your team can't follow up on anything because you're dead and you can't churn out healing. Please try to use your max range as best as possible. Please try to, like, quick scope more so you can get, like, better shots from max range. Please try to stop getting caught out by running too far forwards. And the same thing with, like, le like when, when you're trying to lean back in fights too. Like, please be more aware of your surroundings and who is flanking you. It would be so much easier to actually just handle this if you if you don't, like, just give up the, the forefront of the, of the play, whether you're tank or a support. You can't give up, like... The, what's essentially like the line, the, the scrimmage line when you're like going against, like when you're going tank to tank at the, in the middle, you're not going to get any bonuses off that if you keep getting caught out. Look, real talk chat, I'm not feeling well. Yeah. I ain't gonna die. I can't die. But yeah, I am gonna take a break. Um. Look, yeah, I'm not feeling good, chat. I 
I'm going to lie down and see how I feel. And if worst comes to worst, I'll go see a doctor. But yeah, I think, I think it's just exhaustion still piling on, but I'm going to see how I feel. Sorry, chat. Thanks for everyone that came. Um, I'll probably make up for it by finishing Overwatch tomorrow if I'm feeling better. But yeah, we'll see how we go. Don't say sorry, go rest. Oh, thank you. All right, I'm going to go rest. You take it easy, chat. Thanks. Bye.